Meanwhile, the Nigerian Army has won the most medals at the Nigerian Armed Forces Games 2024 with a total of 264 medals. The Nigerian Army hold 172 gold, 60 silver and 32 bronze medals, clinching the first position in the Games held in Kaduna State. The Nigerian Air Force came second with 33 gold, 103 silver and 51 bronze medals, making a total of 187 medals. The Nigerian Navy came third position with a total of 129 medals, consisting of 18 golds, 43 silvers and 68 bronze. Speaking at the closing ceremony, the Chief of Defence Staff, General Christopher Musa, said the event brought together the finest men and women of the armed forces of Nigeria. Musa explained that the occasion, which saw over 1,600 athletes from the Army, Navy and Air Force, was essential in preparing Nigeria's team for the Africa Military Games, scheduled for November 2024 in Abuja. Also speaking, the Kaduna State Governor, Senator Bersani, who was represented by Commissioner of Internal Security and Homes Affairs, uh, Samuel Aruan, reiterated the government's commitment towards tackling insecurity in the country. These games have also reminded us that the physical and mental well-being of our soldiers is crucial in the face of ever-evolving security challenges. Ensuring that our men and women are in peak condition it's not just a matter of pride, but a necessity for operational effectiveness. Your participation here reinforces the vital connection between fitness, readiness, and overall military performance. That the federal government, under the leadership of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu, will do everything possible to safeguard lives and property for even development across the country. As a government that is responsible for the well-being of its citizenry, it shall not relent in its effort to secure a better Nigeria for our children. The clarion call, therefore, is for us to intensify our fight against security threats to ensure a free, safe, and egalitarian Nigeria and the entire African continent.